Hello, and welcome to another wonderful Wired Wednesday. My name is Ashley, and this is Printch. Don't have a printer at home? No problem. Printing a document or photo to the library is as easy as using a website or downloading an app. How does it work? You send your document or photo to the printer through an app or through the website, and then you can pick it up at Craigleith Heritage Depot or the Ellie Shore Library during our open hours. You also pay online securely, so you've already paid, so you just have to pick it up. In this video, I'll show you how to download the Print app or access Print through our library website. We'll go through this step by step together. So the first thing you want to do is just go into our website, thebluemountainslibrary.ca. Under Services, go into Mobile Printing. And here we are. So it shows you here how to print from your laptop or Chromebook. So here's what, how, what we're going to do first, because I'm going to download the app onto a device and show you how to do that as well. But right now, this is from the website. So you're going to open a browser and go into print.printch.com. So I'm just going to copy that and just paste it into a new window print.printch.com. Then the first thing it's asking you to do is to enter your printer ID. So the printer ID actually is just right on our website right here. So it's 803625. So I'm going to go back in there and type in 803625. It's looking up the printer and here we are. So this is the Ellie Shore Library uh, um, Office Color Printer. So what you're going to do is you're going to upload your file. So you want to make sure that your file is already on your computer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my email and get a file. So for example, I have my email here and this PDF document. So I'm going to open my email. So if you have a Gmail address or if you have a Hotmail address, just go into your email and get the document that you have. If you don't already have it on your computer. If you already have it on your computer, then you can skip this step. So I'm just going to download my file. So once again, this could be a, a doc file, it could be a PDF file, it could be a photo, a JPEG, a PNG, whatever, whatever you'd like to print. So I'm just going to, um, I'm just going to go back now in here. Whoops, there we go. And where it says click here and select and upload a file, I'm going to hit that. And I'm going to go into downloads because that's where mine saves. So it depends on where you save it. So on your computer, it could save to your desktop, it could save to your downloads. Typically, if you download it from online, it's going to be in your downloads folder. So I'm going to hit that. I'm going to open it. And it's processing. So there it is there. So as you can see, you can choose here if it's going to be black and white or color. So this is black and white. And this one here is color. So the ones that look like color, the other one looks like black and white. And then it tells you how many pages it is and how much it's going to cost. So for this one here, it's only one page, so it's 25 cents. If it was color, I'll just click it over to color, it'll be 50 cents because it's 50 cents a page for color and 25 cents a page for black and white. So I'm just going to go back to black and white because I don't need color. And then here's how many copies of it that you'll need. So you can choose how many copies and you'll see that the number will go up for the copies that you need. But I only need one copy of this. And then this other button here just gives you different things. So if you want, if there's a document you only want a certain amount of pages for, you can do the page range from like, you know, page two to page six or something like that. Print on both sides. You can say yes or no if you want it on both sides. If you want it one-sided, just say no. Um, but it's already set to no anyways. And then the paper format. So if it's a legal document that you're printing where you need the longer paper, um, you can hit legal or then there's letter as well. So I just need this to be in letter. So that's fine. So I'm going to accept that. And then you're going to accept the terms and conditions and hit continue. And then however you're going to pay. So um, you can pay with MasterCard, Mastro, Visa as well. Um, also, if you have a PayPal account, you can pay with PayPal. And then print with password, that's something for us at the library. So for example, if you're going to hit your MasterCard. And then you're going to put in your card number and hit complete payment. And that's how you print. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to install Print on Android. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go in and you're going to go into your Play Store. 
So I'm just gonna start typing in Play Store and it looks like this one here. It's just a um, triangle, it's kind of on its side and blue and red and yellow. So now that we're in here, you're just gonna go up to the top here and you're gonna type in Princh, P-R-I-N-C-H. And this is Princh, so hit install. Alright, so it's now installed, so we're going to hit open. So it's going to ask you for permission. So you want Prince to be able to allow you to access your photos and your media on your device because that's how you're going to get the stuff you need to print. So you're going to hit allow. And then enable printing to Prince. So Prince has to be able to show over top of your other apps, so you have to allow a permission for that. So you're going to hit OK, and it's going to take you into your permissions. So you're going to go down till you see Princh under P. And see it said not, if we go back here, it says not allowed. So now you're going to hit Princh and you're going to allow display over other apps. And now it's just opening it up. So I'm not going to show the tutorial today. However, if you'd like to look at the tutorial, feel free to do so. I'm just going to skip that. And then now it's showing you that you can print your documents. So you're going to go out of this, but not completely out of it. So you're basically going to leave it open. So I'm just going to hit my middle button, kind of swipe it up. And then I'm going to go in what I want to go into print. So for me, what I'm going to do with this one, because I showed you in the other ones how to download a PDF from your email and to print it that way, um, it just works the same way. So you basically are just going to go into your email. You're going to grab your file, download it to your phone, find it in your phone, and then you can do the same thing. For this one, I'm going to actually show you how to do a photo out of your Google Photos. So I'm going to just, like I said, we're just going to leave it up and I'm going to go here and I'm going to go into my Photos app. And then I'm going to go down here and I'm going to print this picture of my sister. So I'm just going to go up to the three dots up at the top here. So you select whatever, printer, whatever um, picture you'd like to print. Go here and then you're going to go to print. And then you're going to choose your printer. So Princh is the printer that you're going to choose. It's through the app. So you have to choose what size you'd like it. So if you wanted to completely, so it's letter size. So you're going to do letter size and then it'll um, stretch it out to your letter size. And then you can do your, your you can do it landscape or you can do it portrait. And then there's, there's a few more options as well. But for this, we're just going to do this. And then once you've decided this looks good, so yep, this looks good to me, I'm going to hit the print button, use print. So just saying your document may pass through one or more servers on its way to the printer, and that's okay. So you're gonna hit okay. It's gonna open the print app. And you're going to enter your ID. So I'm gonna hit enter ID. And then the ID, which can be found on our website, is 803-625. Okay. And then the Ellie Shore Office Color Printer. Yes, that's where I want to print it to. Print on both sides. No, we don't need to. Color print. So in this one, in this case, you want to say yes. And then you can see here that one, one color page is 50 cents. So then you're going to hit print. You're seeing this is what it's going to cost. You're going to hit accept the terms and conditions. Continue. You can choose to pay how you'd like to pay for it. So you can pay with a credit card. You can pay with your PayPal account if you have it. So I'm just going to hit pay with credit card. I'm not going to actually put it through, but I'm just going to show you. So this is what it looks like. So once you type in your credit card number here, you can go through and then you can hit complete payment and then it will send it to us at the library. And you can pick that up once again during our open hours that we have. Um, and then you just come for the curbside pickup and then tell us that you have it. We'll, gr we'll grab it off the printer for you and it'll be all good to go. And that's Prince.